Hey, thanks for watching Coffee Pips. I do appreciate you stopping by and supporting my channel today. So today I'm going to be talking about Carrie's Krispies. Carrie's Krispies, that's right. They make gigantic Rice Krispie treats. Not just gigantic Krispie treats, tasty gourmet Krispie treats. Okay, so I have to admit, I had to try these or try some of them before we even started. I couldn't wait. This was an at random shoot. So what I did is I drove down the street. I seen this bright blue turquoise buildings and it said Carrie's Krispies right across the front of it. So I thought Carrie's Krispies. Oh my God. I seen these things in restaurants and in stores and delis and all over the place. I always wanted one. I always wanted one. And I thought, no, nah, because I'd have to share it. Well, I would have to share it because it's way too big. And I thought, oh no, I'm just not gonna get anything that's, well, I should have. Okay, so here nor there. I went into the store, saw every, it was like a kid in the candy store, except a kid in the Rice Krispie Treat store. I had to read a couple of the Rice Krispie Treats that they have. Amaretto, I like Amaretto. There's original, chocolate, caramel cashew, chocolate covered cherry. Why the heck didn't I get chocolate covered cherry? I can eat a whole box of those chocolate covered cordial cherries. It's my favorite. Darn it. Fruity rainbow. It's not like that. I said that that's not like that pebbles crap either because these are all gourmet. White chocolate pretzel, root beer and pretzels. Why didn't I try that one? Well, you know what? There's hundreds of them to try. They make them fresh every day. The store is packed full of these gourmet Rice Krispie treats. The first one I'm going to try is the orange dreamsicle. Yes, it's bright orange. Okay. So these were all wrapped to save you the pain of unwrapping them all. I did it ahead of time. Plus I got to take a little nibble. Okay. So this is the Dreamsicle, the orange Dreamsicle. Wow. I barely got into my mouth and it's an orange Dreamsicle for sure. Look at it. White chocolate chip. I could have this all day, all day long. I'm done. I'm just going to eat this. Really good. Really, really, really good. Okay, so I'm here at Carrie's Krispies in West Dallas. They make Rice Krispie treats in just about every flavor you can think of. Look at this. They have summer flavors, pineapple, Mai Tai. Oh, does that look good? Root beer. And very, very, wow, I have so many flavors. There's a habanero one. Oh, look at this. Turtle candy. And they make them fresh every day. I go to restaurants, they have them. I go to stores, they have them. So they ship all over the place. These things are this big, they're huge. What are they like 4.6 ounces or something like that? Square little brick. Wow, maple bacon, almond pistachio. That's one of my favorites. Well, I've never had it. I don't know if it's one of my favorites, but sounds really good. Rocky Road. That'll satisfy a sweet tooth for sure. Rocky Road. You know, Rocky Road has the marshmallows, peanuts, everything rocky about it. I have, huh, look at a little piece of that cut already. I did eat a peanut off of the other one. Here, I wonder how this would taste if you like cut up some and you put them on Rocky Road ice cream. Hmm, that's my invention. So good. So good. Coffee, toffee, caramel cinnamon roll, strawberry, puppy chow. Puppy chow is my absolute favorite. 
in puppy chow form. I never had it in a Rice Krispie Treat form. The puppy chow. <laughs> Told ya. I'm gonna forget what you want I tried and I'm gonna have to try them all over again. Powdered sugar. Smells like puppy chow. I would think I'm eating a bag of puppy chow. The only time I get puppy chow is when I go to a bake sale, like where nuns make it and stuff like that. Well, I don't know if nuns make it or grannies or whoever, but puppy chow is really good. This is perfect. Absolutely perfect. And of course, the texture, the Rice Krispies, out of this world. Four for $15, that's a deal. And these are all double deckers. Double, you get like double the regular Krispie treat like your mom used to make. Like I said, they make all right here fresh. I've heard nothing but good things about this place. What are you making right now? Uh, right now I'm cutting up salted caramel brownies. Salted caramel? Mm -hmm. Oh my God, that sounds wonderful. Do you sell a lot of those? Yeah, actually, this is actually my favorite flavor. Make sure that you visit Carrie's Crispy. There's a link for their website below. And hey, while you're at it, subscribe. Subscribe below, hit that bell, and I'll keep you posted with new videos that come up each and every week. Even if you like just a teeny bit of my videos, please hit that bell and subscribe and give me a like. Thank you so much. I know I could count on you. Okay, salted caramel. And this one I didn't try. I didn't, honest. Maybe, no I didn't. I'm not a big salted caramel guy. Salto, salted caramel brownie. Oh my God, I don't keep on saying that, but the big brownie chunks, the salted caramel Rice Krispies, I'm gonna weigh a hundred million pounds. These are so good, I can't believe it. And I'll tell you what, when I walked in that store, the girl was so nice, told me about all the Rice Krispie treats, and she was even making them fresh when I came in. So nice, nice people. In the middle and salted caramel, all oh, that sounds wonderful. And then they even have the scraps, so nothing goes to waste for a dollar. You have birthday cake, s'mores. You know how I don't like hot stuff? I get mail every day. Well, not every day, I'm making myself sound really popular. But I do get mail, I get emails with people saying, eat this hot thing, eat that hot thing. I think they want me to die, yeah, right. So the thing is, I'm really not into hot things anymore. I mean, I really never was, but I do them, I do them for you because I won't back down on a dare on pips. Okay. Oh, oh. I'm already a crybaby. Go to commercial. Oh, wait a minute. We don't have commercials. Well, we do. It's a YouTube commercial, but I don't have like a commercial commercial. Okay, here we go. Habanero berry. Uh, uh. Not a problem. No problem at all. It's a habanero. Big deal. Mmm, it has a little sting to it. You know what though? It's not bad. It's really not bad. Just enough. Just enough the sweet with the pepper and the Rice Krispie, the texture, the color too. You will never have your mother make Rice Krispie treats again. 
and you will never buy the ones that are in the blue box again. Who would, who would do that after having one of these? I'm sure they ship. Sorry. I never point a knife at anybody. I'm sure that they ship. You can order actually catering. You can order like a whole platter or a half a platter and I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna be the hero. So what is this, like $100? $20? Come on and get all these Rice Krispie treats for $20. Absolutely. And thank you so much. I'm going to stop by again, or I'll just pick them up in a store that I... Okay, so go to their website. I'll have a link in the description below. So as I'm walking out the door, I got a complimentary Carrie's Crispy. Now, don't expect this. It's for Pips only. Coffee with Pips. So you can't miss this. This is on the corner of 72nd and Feature Street. The big blue building and with the Terry Krispies logo on it. So make sure you stop by. You won't believe what you'll find inside. Well, I'll tell you, I ate my share of Carrie's Rice Krispie Treats today. This place is awesome. Again, a link for their website is in the description below. I went in there at random, surprised the hell out of everybody. And I'll tell you what, I will go back. Let's see if they ship these things. I'm sure that they do. Again, catering, you can buy a full platter, half platter, anything that you want. They always have new flavors, and again, they make them fresh every single day. Wow, I can't say enough. And on that note, have a great week.